Ladies and gentlemen, kids of the Rangers, welcome to World Chess League Live. It is the third, fourth playoff, first game. I've got to remember that third, fourth playoff, and it's between none other than Dundee City and University of Birmingham. And these two teams have just played matches, and I have been witness to Dundee, who almost took out Politica, almost took out Politica. Politica were holding on by a string. Thank heavens to their board four. They fought back and snatched it from the jaws of defeat, which uh, pushed Dundee City into the third, fourth playoff. So hopefully the final is going to be exciting as that match was, because I'm pity we missed that one. But uh, we are here now, and we've got uh, Dundee City versus University of Birmingham. Now, I don't want to be the bearer of bad news here, but I think after that very, very, very close call, it is going to be... A Dundee Massacre. I know. I'm very brave st stating things like the Dundee Massacre, isn't it? But I do think that Birmingham might be outgunned, outmanned, and outplayed in this round. I could be wrong. I normally am. No, I'm not normally that wrong. But I could be wrong today. So, welcome to Live. It is the third and fourth playoff, ladies and gentlemen. We'll have none other than one of the best... Online organizers in the world, Peter Hornsby joining us, and I think he's going to join us for commentary. Now, his commentary is really bad if you guys haven't mentioned before. He's terrible at commentary. He'll talk about the chess league, he'll talk about people's histories. Moves, not so much, not, not in his forte. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. He can actually play some chess. Well, at least he knows how the knight moves, right? That's that's the thing. He need he knows how the knight moves. We're okay, he can he can move pieces. <laughs> um so, yeah, and, uh, of course, with the third and fourth playoffs, they are playing for for prize money. Um, the prize fund is 5000 US dollars, all sponsored by Chess.com. And uh, this is the end of this season, and the new season will be coming rapidly and fast without you even knowing it. Uh, Chess Heroes will be back to streaming days. We're going to be streaming the... Will Chess League Diet Live, and hopefully we can we can make it a regular Sunday event. We just got to get you know Peter on board, and I know that on on Sundays Peter likes to sleep in, you know, typical Englishman, don't want to get out of bed type of thing, you know. So um, hopefully, hopefully, just hopefully, we will be okay with that. Um, but when he comes on, we 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 can we can pressure him, right? We can pressure him. There's nothing wrong with pressuring Peter. He loves it. Um, and with regards to uh, regards to this match, we have a 4v4. And what do we've got? We've got Ripple at a 2382 versus a Gazakul at 2273. We've got Scientific Mouse at 2356 versus GRG27 at 2134. Uh, a Giant Mutant Octopus at 2304 versus Goliva at 2000. And... Five five six two thousand five one twelve sounds like an IP address, ladies and gentlemen. I'm pretty sure that sounds like an IP address. Uh, they against against Silent Knight. Well, I think he's going to be silenced by five five six two thousand and twelve. No, I'm not lying. It's not two thousand and twelve. It's two thousand and five hundred. Two thousand five hundred twelve. So yeah, Dundee, all about winning this round. Uh, the match should start in 46 seconds. Hopefully, soon enough, we should have Peter. Uh, I'm sure he will He will join us very, very shortly. Very, very shortly. And, uh, and uh, <clears throat> we've got a match on our hands. 23 seconds to the third, fourth playoff. You know, this sounds like the European Championships here. Did anybody see the third fourth playoffs? Because I thought the third fourth playoffs would be between Germany and, uh, or as it was, France. Was France knocked out by Spain? France was knocked out by Spain. Yes, yes. So France, uh, France and uh, the Netherlands. But I didn't see the third fourth playoff scheduled. Maybe I'm wrong um, for the European Championships. It is England versus Spain tonight. So we can give Peter a little bit of stick about England as well. You know, we, we like to, to spread... Spread all sports around. He's going to give me stick about the rugby. You know, the Springboks versus Ireland. I'm going to say it was a typical English ref getting it all wrong as always. 
But uh, it's all about the banter. It's all about the chess. And we are in it, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. This is it. No, I can't hear you. <laughs> I can sense you. I just want to do that. There we go. There we go. You got your pretty face on screen, Peter. Uh, we're getting the games up and running. Uh, what did I do now? Did I do them all? I hope I did them all. Let's see games. What? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm low. Yeah, yeah, I've got Scientific, Goo Lover, 556, five, oh, I'm missing Ripple. Right, okay, so we'll let's do what we always do. We'll go to the bottom of the log. No, I'm kidding. We'll go to the, bo the, the bottom player who is 556. Five, and watch, that's the button. Yes, they made this so complicated. Watch, games, open. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> right, 
I'm go I'm gonna hop right right into the commentary there, Peter. As well, now that, that, that we got all the names out of the way, and uh, obviously this was a Queen's Gambit, uh, something or other. You know, just a Queen's Gambit. Why not? So we're not gonna go into too much detail. Yes, Black has swiped a pawn quietly off the board there, but it is not doom and gloom. Those of you that think that losing a pawn in this game is going to make a big difference, no, it's not. The big difference is, and I would like to point out, is which knight is actually going to do the damage. Um, at the moment, both knights are being well tamed by the bishops. The bishops are all very, very active. Uh, Black's b-pawn is looking very, very ominous. And it's all about what is white going to do. Yes, f7 looks very juicy. If you could play bishop takes f7, king takes f7, you would love to play rook takes. But there is a rook and a knight defending it. So it doesn't quite work right there yet. Knight can't go to e5. The knight and the bishop are covering it. The black bishop, if you had to look at the bishop pairs, which bishop pair is probably stronger at this point in time? Slight edge to black with the bishop pair. Slight edge with the knight because the white knight doesn't have much to go. There it goes. Knight g5 looking at f7. But I think black is just quite comfortably going to play bishop g6 and say, right, now what are you going to do? Your knights come all the way over here for absolutely no. Enjoying the commentary as always. Definitely the most exciting sporting event of the day. No, 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 no. Yes, maybe. Kind of. I don't know. Peter, Peter I might disagree on this. The most uh, fascinating... <laughs> Yes, no, 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 Andrew Todd. <laughs> I remember Andrew. It was like... Thank you, Timmy, for the follow. We appreciate it. Enjoy the match. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I, I decided that if I'm going to come back to streaming. I'm going to make this as entertaining as possible. I might not know much about the chess, but it's going to be entertaining one way or another. I, I had to go at you while you... <laughs> I uh, I had a go at you. No, 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 not at all. Um, I I did have a I did have a go at you before before we we started the stream. You know, being uh, England are playing Spain in the Euros. We've got uh, English team versus a, a Scottish team. If it was a Spanish team, it would be brilliant because it'd be England versus Spain. It's a, you know Euros all over again. Uh... <laughs> Oh. Yeah, let's go to oh, 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 what was, what was, what was Giant Mutants. Yes, let's go have a look at Giant Mutants. I don't know him. <laughs> okay. Giant Oh my gosh, that queen is looking beautiful. This is game over. This game set match. Thank you for playing. Come back next week. Uh, no, no, no. The the big the big question is why do you play rookie one of all the moves? Why do you play rookie one? You got a rook behind a pawn. It's rooks behind the pawn with past pawn is what you want, and you go and give away. You go and take. Oh no 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 no. Rookie one just. Ooh, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if Rook. D I, I mean, if you play Rook D one, I'm gonna go Queen D E two anyway. Like, I I don't I don't see I don't see the the benefits of the Rook moving at all. Um. <laughs> Let's go to Scientific Mouse. Yeah, Scientific Mouse. Well, well, Dunny, well, Dunny's gonna love this. I mean, on board three we got a pass pawn. On board four, on board two we got pass pawns. We got a bishop, a rook, all looking very, very untidy. 
I know it's it's beautiful. And look at look at that bishop. I mean, if you ever wanted a piece, oh my gosh, that cannot be good. Knight that knight must not be a good move. Knight c six must be must be considering a knight c six must be considering if queen f six bishop to d five. Oh, that 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 knight move was that. I don't think that knight. I think knight c six, queen f six, bishop to e five, maybe, maybe not, maybe not. But then you got knight ninety ninety four ninety four, and then you got knight to oh my gosh ninety four knight to to c to e to d six. Oh no, this is this is gonna hurt. I think 96, 94, 96. Woo! I, I know players that would be like, yeah. Let's let's have our knights on the sixth rank and we have a pass pawn. What more could you ask for? No, this is uh this is not looking good for GR27. And Birmingham could be very easily two pawns down. You've got to be careful because even if you take the pawn, I've got knight to e7, and then knight takes c8, and then I've got rook to d1. But maybe maybe that's why he's not... Ooh, oh, 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 even better yet. Oh, I can't do it. Oh, I wanted to play neon 94 first. Oh, hey, Keitho, my boy, welcome. Welcome. Congratulations on coming. Was it second in the SA Open? Not so long ago, but like a week ago. Well done, dude. Very, very, very good. Oh, you went for knight c6. I am a GM. He went for knight c6. <laughs> He's obviously not worried about queen takes uh, queen takes c5. I don't know. All right, let's go to Ripple. Ripple absolutely ripped the party's opponent in the previous round. Uh, let's go look here. I just couldn't resist Rip and Ripple, you know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is is black is black in big big? Tr oh, okay. So there's there's G. You've got to worry about G three here, G two here. But queen takes e6 just looks just looks so juicy. It's just so dependent. You know, you just want to play it. You just really want to play queen takes e6. But I don't think it's enough. I think it's I think it has problems because the bishop the bishop can go to e6. You've got queen takes e g2. Ooh, this is exciting stuff. Inciting. I don't know the normal Dundee A team, but with some very strong players from there, has their lineup been affected by the Scottish Championship, or is this their normal team? That's for you, Peter. Oh, that's always good. I don't see that to be a problem. Are you are you are you are you stating this is a middle game, Peter? Well, I was going to say more leaning to an end game here. Okay, let me put it this way: if the queens came off right now, they no. No, you can't say that. You can have queens in an end game. Come now. <laughs> 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, I, I, I will say that if you, if you did, if, if the queens did come off now, that you're probably very much likely in an end game at that point. Yeah, and all, and, all, and all you naughty people out there, and, and I mean the youngsters and all the ones that are generally beginners, don't play King F1, right? The guy is 2 2 seven, three. He knows what he's doing. You won't. Don't do it. Try, like, really, don't do it. Don't do it. Castle when you can. He couldn't castle in this position uh, due to threats on G2, but generally castle. Don't not castle. It's very bad not to castle. Ask Keith. He likes it when his king goes running around the board. <laughs> no. There we go. Do as I say, not as I do. Hundred percent. And uh, this is this is interesting because Black must be tempted to play Rook F six. If he does, Queen C two. Ooh, H right. Wait, I got. Wait, wait. I got. I got to lean back for this. Lean back for this. I've got to work this. Up. H, H five. Um, absolute. I, I have lovely words for this, but I can't use it on stream. <laughs> I, I can use I can use an English term, bugger all. <laughs> I mean, I thought rook f six here for black would be the the key factor. Man, this looks. Oh 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 oh! Let's a five. No a five a five a five. I'm saying a five. Let's go a five. A five, A five. Bishop A six, Bishop A six. <laughs> that that that's is is beneficial. That that that's a Brett move. A five is a Brett move. So you know we'll put it down. <laughs> a Peter move. A Peter move would be a king move now. <laughs> no, but but rook f six, he just he just he just has queen e two. So it's okay. No, but I'm saying if you had played rook f six, you had queen e two. But this is why a five was interesting. Because a. On e on e six. Uh. Oh, we got results. We got results. We got results. Silent Knight takes down five five six two thousand one twelve, and Giant Octopus brings one back for Dundee. But we did expect Giant Mutant to bring it, and we do expect Scientific Mouse. The question is: Is Ripple going to rip this one apart? Now, you know, Peter, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> too late, too late, too late, she cried. <gasps> oh, you know, you know what? You know what? He actually missed the win. <coughs> Rook F6. <coughs> Queen E2. Bishop A6. Good night, sweetheart. It's time to go. Oh, my goody golly way. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. It would have been interesting. <coughs> are they are they finished or, or how they started? Their second games. Which What, what do you want? Ah, the first games. Oh, I have to do it the hard way now. You see, you make it difficult. <laughs> We we can we can we can we can have a recap when the other two are finished. We'll have a quick recap. Da -da 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 -da.
Yes. Okay. Rush. What was what was what? Oh, a scientific rust. <coughs> well, I don't know. I, I, maybe you guys can help me. A bishop and a knight versus a bishop. I wonder who is going to win. Like this is what this is. Uh, this is sadness for black. And you, you know what? You know. No, hold on. I can I can play knight f six. Knight takes h five. G takes h five. King takes h five, and I win. Yeah, and I've got a passport, and I'm pro and I'm protecting the pro the promoting. Oh oh oh! Is he gonna do it? Is he gonna do it? Is he gonna do it? He's not gonna do it, is he? He's not gonna. Oh oh! He's setting up mates. He's setting up mates on. Oh my god! Oh my god! He's setting up mates. He's setting up mates on. Oh my god! Bishop. C5 is mate. Oh, so much for mate. So much for mate. But he's going to pick up the F pawn. He's going to pick up the F pawn. Okay, can, can, we, can we classify this as scientific mouse's game? Oh, he just takes bishop, takes pawn. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Oh, is, oh, is, oh, I thought you were going to play F4 there for a second. Oh, G5, G4. No, G4, man, G4. It's calling you. I'm going to start. Oh, he's going to go knight G5 and then take the F7 pawn. Ah, oh, sadness. Sadness epitified. So... Yeah, scientific mouse takes it. Let's go to Ripple. Maybe, maybe something exciting has happened on, on his game. I hope. Seven seconds, Peter. Seven seconds for White. Oh, is there is there mating opportunities here? Rook takes G three. Pawn takes G three. Ooh. Yeah, no, this is, this is absolute, oh, no, 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 this is sadness, can't we play bishop, oh, I want to play bishop e2, queen g5, bishop f3, Oh, I think he missed. I think he missed the win. Rook takes f two. Rook takes g three. <clears throat> yeah. Rook takes. Rook takes f two. Rook takes f two. Rook takes. Ah, uh, I think he. I think he missed it. Oh no! Craziness. I don't know why he doesn't play rook takes f two. Yeah, black white saw it because he's brought his bishop. He brought his bishop back. He's like, ah, oh, I see what you're up to, you evil devil. Oh, man. Rook takes f2. I'm 99% I'm rook takes f2 works, man. Rook takes f2. Rook takes. Rook takes pawn. Check. Queen takes, and I've got mate. Oh, wait. The queen's covering on, C th on, on f7. Okay, that's fine. Queen was covering on c7. That's sad. That's why he didn't play it. The queen's covering on c7. Covering the g3 square. Evil queen. How dare you cover the, the, the square. Guys, by all means, if you're in, if you're in chat, by all means, suggest moves that you think guys are going to play. Uh, say what you... If you think we're talking absolute rubbish, please say so. I don't mind. It doesn't affect me. I'm only I'm only a pleb in the pawn structure, so uh, and and Peter really doesn't mind you know people suggesting moves. So by all means, get involved. I mean this is this is the third or fourth playoff. We're not excited about this. Ooh, good. 
Good night. Queen, queen check. Oh, queen check. Queen check. Queen check. Queen check. Queen check. Are we getting a queen check? Yeah, we're getting a queen check. Then what? Then what? The stupid. Yes, but we, we, we. Yeah, yeah. Aha, uh aha. -huh. Uh -huh. But why? Why would we want to draw when we can win? Oh, ripples in time travel. Ripples in time travel. Wait, we got it. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, 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 oh. I got a great idea. Rook f6. Yeah, yeah. Then rook takes h pawn. Pawn takes rook g6. Oh, but that's a pawn. Oh, 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 is that a mistake? Is that a mistake? No, no, no. I'm looking at rook takes pawn. Yes. He's done it. I don't know if it's enough. Oh yes, that's the, that's the move I'm missing. The e3, e3, and it's all she wrote now. Oh, oh, rook back. Whew. Hello, rookie to g6. <laughs> and guys, he's seeing that he's seeing this with 18 seconds left on his clock. Oh, he can't play. Rook takes pawn. Oh, rook takes that pawn. Yes, that's the pawn. Now rook takes the queen takes the pawn. Come on, yay! Queen takes the pawn. Queen takes the pawn. We go queen checky. We do indeed. Do we play? Oh, we can't play king h six. Don't play king h six. Whatever you do, don't play queen h six. Okay, king queen takes pawn. Must be. He's going for the draw. No, can't go for the draw. Oh, you, maybe he's playing to get some time, eh? Push his time up to twenty eight seconds. Yeah, take that pawn. Steal them pawns. Oh, he was worried about that check. Okay. But okay, now. Okay. I think he wants pawns. I think he's gone pawn hunting. Remember that H pawn, that A pawn is a problem. Okay, can't can we play? Can't we play king? How about king h6 now? King h6. King h6 with rook g5, rook g3 coming. Come on, it's got, it's got, it's got to be king h6. Oh, seven six, no. Oh. Ten seconds, eight seconds. Why oh, he's cutting it fine? King h6, mate. Yay! But it, it doesn't work as effectively as the queen on g2, man. Come on, laddie. Or does it? Oh, you know what he's going for? Rook g3, queen e2, mate. Rook g3. King e4. Queen e2 mate. Oh, seven seconds and counting. The pressure's on. University of Birmingham. Oh, 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 oh. This is, this is, this is. Oh, what? Why? Oh. No, rook g3. Uh, he's going for the simple win now. He can't see the mate. He's going for the. He's going for the trade off. Keith, did you see Rook G three? All right, did you see Rook G three? I know Brett saw Rook G three. Brett saw Rook G three. <laughs> Got to activate the game. Come on. Zabita, this is still a middle game, eh? <laughs> All right, so rip, ripple, ripple, take this, and this should be uh, this should be three one to Dundee. So I'm just gonna pop onto the bottom board to see what happened in the 
Oh, resign. That's all I saw. Let's just see. <clears throat> uh, oh, yeah. So this is where it was. Um, and I said black was looking better. <clears throat> black had the extra pawn. Oh. Oh, two pieces and two pawns versus a rook. Yeah, no, this is toast. This is over. Yeah, no. Well played. Well played, Silent Knights. You were a silent assassin in that one. And then let's go to Giant. See what happened in Giant. This is pretty. Yeah, this is pretty much where we were. Then he took. Yeah, okay. This was just. I mean, this was just purely a simplistic uh, queen pawn ending. No, too easy. Too easy for Giant Mutant. Don't need to go further than that. That was game, set, and match. All right, let's go back to um, Sir Knight. Four. Yes. And we have... Ooh! Oh, 556-2000 has fought back. He's got two pawns, and they are storming the queen side with a rook in tandem. And, and if that is the case, Ripple brings in the point. Dundee brings in the point. Dundee finished third in the uh, World Chess League Live Championship. I, I always get the name of the tournament. The, the, but the tournament keeps changing names. It's probably going to be something else next season, you know. <laughs> uh, let's have a sip of that. And oh, yeah, no. Okay, what? Oh, the Bible. Yes. Yes. I need to, I need to get hold of them. Does the tournament usually struggle... Wait, does the tournament usually struggle so many with fair play? For we don't actually. Um, in all fairness, and I, I let me can I can I enjoy this, you know? Can I enjoy this statement on your behalf, right? Can I enjoy this? So, the tournament's been running for four years online. Four years online, and with regards to the fair play. Out of the four years, and I stand to be corrected, let's say we've played 5,000 games of chess. Give or take. Okay. If we've had 100 cases of fair play violation, it's a lot. I think if I remember correctly, in total, we've probably only had about 10 fair play violations. Give or take. How, how bad it... In, in history. In hi, No, no, in history. Let's see... But it progressively got it progressively got lower and lower. Yeah, this season's under uh, Cappy, this season is under ten. There we go. Okay. Dudney are third 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 in the World Chess League dot live championships for this season. Which season is which season is it? Twenty twenty four. Nice. Oh, what?
Yeah, but but I think I think I also want to add to this, Peter, is that you know a lot of the captains that bring their teams in, generally speaking, when a new team joins, we have a hiccup with the team in the sense that there might be a violation, might be, um, not always the case, but once they get familiar with the rules and that, and they realize that the team gets punished for it, it is very quick that the team does not allow any suspect player to play in their team. In general, it happens. Um, I mean, 80 teams with an average average of four players per team. It's 320 players. So, no, 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 no. I'm I'm working on the average the average of four 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 players per team, which is which is 320 players. But we know that we've had teams that have 20, 16, 18. I know this because sometimes Peter makes sure I stream 25 boards. <laughs> Hundred percent. The the best the best way for this tournament is to have a good stable six to eight players available on a regular basis. Play with about four or five players every week, or well, every whatever we just whatever the the new the new structure is going to be. And and Cappy, yes, you know what? Um, if you look if you look in the context of the tournament, I'm I'm pretty sure, and I mean. I mean, Peter could go dig. I know he's not going to, but he he does normally have these stats normally ready on hand. I'm saying if there were 20 players banned for fair play in this tournament this year, it was a lot. Remember, also a lot of the time, um, or a lot of the games we try and stream as well. Guys don't want to get caught cheating while you're streaming. They just generally don't want that to happen. They want to be, you know, praised. And we've we've had some great. Great games, great players. I mean, Harry Houdini, I don't know what his, what his username was, but I mean, he was completely busted the game and he managed to turn the game around and won. got a clip about it. It, was, it went on YouTube. It, it, you know, we, we try and make it fun that everybody wants to be a part of it. And Yeah, because cause last year there were a couple. Six one to Dundee with Ripple to go. <laughs> what what's the chances of Ripple offering a draw? <laughs> No, 
No, let me think about that. Mm. <laughs> I've got something on YouTube. Uh, I know, I know, I know, I'll put it on YouTube straight as, as soon as we finish, absolutely. But, uh, I mean, this match is over. Congratulations, Dundee, on finishing third. One place better than last year. That's that's always a great improvement. Uh, unlucky to Birmingham. Did exceptionally well. I, might, I must admit, I didn't expect them to get this far. So, very, very impressed that they that they did. And, uh, and again, a very good third, fourth playoff. Always nice to have a nice run into the final. Um, Uh, Ruti Ruti Hills wasn't a bad, wasn't a bit wasn't a bad team. <laughs> oh, oops, oops. Peter, you haven't typed for all. Mubot hasn't irritated you. Please type in the chat. <laughs> See, Mubot's behaving today. Uh, uh, uh. I do agree, Peter, in that in some of the players have played for four years together and a lot of players in the teams know each other well. Lots of chess friends and rivals, which makes me confident in playing a game that is fair throughout. Always such a good event. To look forward to some top GMs and IMs playing. It's a real experience. Yeah, no, so it's absolutely. Um, you know, you got you got to look at you got to look at the bigger picture, right? How many leagues? And I put it in inverted commas. Does an average Joe like you or me get a chance to play a GM or an IM? I mean, I had the unfortunate pleasure of playing against Ch uh, Chess Club Politico last year, and ran in. I, was it was a GM I ran into or something. And I thought I was doing really well. <laughs> Needless to say, I... <laughs> thanks, Devin. Uh, what's that? The Sky Eagle. No, my clubheads. My clubheads are still working. Oh, I haven't. I haven't disabled that one either. I haven't disabled that one. Uh, I'm sure that in that case, the tournament was fun when separated from multiple cases of cheating. Yeah, Cappy, there weren't that many, dude, really. They, I mean, if I if I recall the first the first year we did this, I mean, every other... Poor, poor Peter, I feel so sorry for him. Every other week, he was, <laughs> he was dealing with a cheating scenario. Like, every round, there was something happened. Some way, something. And we can tell you stories about things that have happened over... Over the past. Um, that, 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 is, that is what. We literally had a 700 rated player. Miss a checkmate in two. Against an FM. Would you get this in any other event? Oh no. Dude no. You forgot about the 13-1400 beating the GM. Remember that Peter. And 
we all kept quiet because we saw it happen and we like all kept quiet. We didn't say a damn word. We were like, very good game, very nice game, water, water, water. But in the back of our minds, and everyone's thinking, and like, how did this guy do it? And then you go back and you look at the game. The GM didn't play well at all. The GM played like absolute nonsense in like Yes. He pl- But 80s, 80s, 80s manageable, Peter. No, no. Cap, Cappy, uh, again, on your, no- on your note, yes, the, we, we have had scenarios where an IM or a GM or an FM or even a 2-3 or 2-2, two, two, um, I got it. Um, two two lost to someone lower rated, and yes, it did come out he's cheated. Oh well, yeah, absolutely. It gets tossed immediately. The team gets penalized because of it, and I promise you, the captain of the team does—he does everything in his power to make sure. I'm saying, and I'm going to categorically state this because. Peter knows I hate cheaters. I hate cheaters online. It irritates the absolute living crap out of me. I state categorically that a tournament with this magnitude of this variety of players, right? At some point, sooner or later, we're actually going to go through a whole season without a cheater in it. And I absolutely believe that. There are rules in place. There are protocols in place. Chess.com is behind it. Peter's on the ball. Captains are on the ball. Um, you know, at the end of the day, and, and the last point on this, because we're not going to go on this, because we're here for chess, not for cheaters. The last point on this is that at the end of the day, you can never stop someone trying to cheat. What you can do is hurt what he does. And the more you do that, the better the tournament becomes. This tournament, by far, and yes, you can say that we are a little biased because we're involved and we've done this now for four years. But if you look at year one and you look at this year in comparison to what we've experienced to what we're experiencing now as we go forward, and Peter is very clear in the email about the cheaters as well in the beginning of the season, and the captains are aware of it. No, no. So, so. So, so Sky, so Sky Legal, Sky Eagle, when it comes to the playoffs, and this is the only time we do it in the background. Now, normally, normally I do it. Peter jumped the gun this week. This is okay. It's less work for me. Normally, what we do is we have the players on a Zoom call, and we are watching the players on the Zoom call. And then what I normally do, and what we normally do is we will show them during the match in the Zoom. We only do that in the playoffs, right? We only do that in the playoffs, especially with the streaming. We generally only do that in the playoffs and the finals and all that. Somewhere we got it wrong this time, but Peter's got it in, on his screen on his side and he's monitoring those players. So they are, you know, in, in the playoffs and we've had four playoffs. We've never had a cheating incident in the playoffs at all. Um, all games have been above board. Everyone's played fairly. Everyone leaves happily. So, yeah, look, we do everything we can. Peter's amazing at doing this. I'm, you know, I'm just a fool on behind the scenes and, you know, do all these little technical things.
Can, can, can I say this game's pretty boring because there's nothing to stick on <laughs> No. <laughs> you... I think I think Ripple is one of the most one of the players that I have streamed the most played in 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 League Twenty Twenty. I remember this username. I remember this username instinctively. I don't know why is his username. I remember. I always remember his name. And one of these days, he's going to get hold of me. He's going to smack me. <laughs> I always have something to say. <laughs> Look, <laughs> yeah. He's expressionless. Yay! Excitement for a whole three seconds. <laughs> So, yeah. Oh, goody. Can I go sleep then? <laughs> But we can we can talk about the new season at least. Boring. <laughs> you know what this reminds me of. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's a European game. A certain English team was like. <laughs> no, 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 no. He's got no real way of, no real way of hitting that E3 ball. Are we are we gonna see Rook C one? Rook S C one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good good idea, Peter. That's a Peter move. Rook B one. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Please do not mention the other spots of it that was did to other shit. No increment. <laughs> Jeez. 
See, I'm I am level. Rook C1, baby. I am level right here. Right over here, I am level. Someone's getting murdered. It's okay. Don't worry, guys. Oh, we're not we're not doing the Champions League system. I like the Champions League system. It was nice. Oh, he played a Peter move. He played a Peter move. Oh, and Birmingham sneak in a point, but it means very little in the greater scheme of things. And Dundee, Dundee City, take. Third place. Well done, guys. I feel this is a shame. Wait. Peter, Peter, Peter. I got something to say. I feel this is a shame. I like the stage system. The group stage system. By Andy Todd. Oh no. Oh no. Toddy 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 Let's 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 start a riot group, right? We'll start a riot group. All those against the 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 the, the league for we want group stage. We want group stage. <laughs> Peter's gonna kill me later, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you, it's, it's all right. Hundred percent. So, so Tony, Tony, we work like this. We work like this. If you, if you send us donations to the channel or, you know, subscriptions to the channel, we have, we have powers that we can make you play ready. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We, we don't do that. <laughs> Before people take me seriously, because if you don't know me, you know I'm joking. <laughs> you still with us, Peter? <laughs> All right. I, I just I just need to go to somewhere quickly. I'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen. See you in two seconds. You don't want any of the hot chips. <laughs> That's good. 30 seconds is good.
Oh, but I can, I, I can, I can at least, I can do the game link. We, oh, now you placed it there. Okay, I can do that. Copy, copy. That's, oh, crap. <laughs> that didn't work. Let's try that again. That failed horribly. Oh, it's all Peter's fault. No, no, I've got the link. It's just, uh, I did it all wrong. There we go. That's the game. Very good. And then it's only the one national anthem, isn't it? And then, um, are they both from Serbia? I don't even know who's in the final. I know, but I know, I know Chess Club Politica A is in the final. Who's? I, I, what's the other team in the final, Peter? Chess Club Politica. Oh, wait, why am I asking? I can look. No, that didn't work. You see, it didn't work. Okay, wait, let me go to my other place to get it. Give me a second. Hold on. Yeah. No, I'm gonna, uh, this is the link for the second game. Okay. Copy. Link. Paste. Ah. ah, Chess Club Dragon. Oh, this isn't this the, the, yes, I'm going to get slapped if I get this wrong. Isn't this the Chinese team, Peter? <laughs> hey! <laughs> no, I know. I know you said they. But I, I, I know. I know you said. I know you said they were both from Serbia. I just had to throw the Chinese for the dragon. You know, you the dragon and all. You what? What? <laughs> all right. So we so we do the the national anthem quickly. All right. I'm going to put myself on mute. Right, lady, you're on mute, Peter, so you can talk as much as you like. You're quiet.
You, you, you are old. I don't know why you feel old. You're all old. <laughs> I, 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 sorry, I, I've picked on, I've picked on you enough today, Pete. I could pick on Daniel. What is this bum fluff going on over there, Danny? <laughs> Cheers, Peter. Enjoy all the all the all the you know facial expressions and whatnot. Right. You know, it, dep it depends what your sixteen players are. If you li lined up with sixteen IMs, um, yeah, I don't think they're going to give them a point. <laughs> How are you doing, Danny? It's been a while. Fantastic. Yeah, no, we survive. You know, we survive slowly but surely. But uh, Chess Club Politica A, R, oh, no, wait, hang on. Peter's going to, did B win it or A win it last year? I know A played B in the final. And I, I know A played B in the final. Yeah. It was quite something that, yeah, no, no, they they had both teams in the final. <laughs> um, I'm I'm not sure I'm not sure if B or A won, but anyway, Chess Club Politica won. <laughs> I see I can't get wrong there. Chess Club Politica won the final. <laughs> um, so technically. Yeah, look, um. You know, as high as the ratings are, I think the big the big issue here is Chess Club Politica have been here, done this. Uh, I think this is their third or fourth final in a row. Um, they uh, they 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 know how to handle the pressure. I, I can tell you from experience, you're not going to see any flashy chess from any of the four boards. It's gonna be it's gonna be solid, it's gonna be boring, it's gonna be grinding, it's gonna be strategical. They'll only really they will only really take the risk round about time pressure. So 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 And you're probably more you more see it in the second round again, not the first. If they go two two, then then you'll see. Yeah. Why not? Who says you can't do it? Of course you can. It just might not be feasible, but you can do it. You can do it. No, no one said that you can't do it. And, 
again, 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 you're just assuming that you can't do these. You can do these things, all right? You can play H4. You can play H4 if you want to. You, no, no, no. In, in, you're right. You know, if you're gonna if you're gonna go if you're gonna go for it, you're gonna need a a strong attacking opening from the start. Um, Chest, Chester Politico are are not that kind of team. You're gonna see the grind right through. It's gonna be a, a it's gonna be a strategic. I I I do not foresee any crazy openings. You might get a banco. We might get a banco. No, but I'm saying we might get a banco, but other. You, you got you got as much chance of seeing an Evan, Evans Gambit as seeing a mermaid in real life. It's not happening. Not not in, not on these not in these. Not. Oh oh oh! One minute, someone disappeared. Oh no 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 no! Not in the final, please, please come back. Oh no. It's 50 seconds. Oh, no. No, 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 no. 2 no advantage. Here, boy, yes. Oh, no, 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 no. We can't have this in the final. Oh. Oh, he's back. 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 All right. All right. Everyone's hearts calm down. It's okay. We, we got four players. That was that was scary. Thirty seconds of a nightmare there, but we'll get through it. It's all good. Um, so we are we going to start at the bottom board just because <laughs> just because <laughs> just because yeah we'll start at the bottom board. Twelve seconds to go. Good luck to Chess Club Politica and Chess Club Dragon. May the best team win on the day. Um, give your give your shout outs, guards. Who are you supporting, Politica or the Dragon? Right, uh, I'm just going to load up all the teams. Oh, that was weird. If anything, it's going to be a three, it's going to be a four and a half, three and a half swing. And, and, uh, uh, I, I'm, I'm going to have to go with Chess Club Politica because they've been here, done that, got the t-shirts. More experience, know how to handle this. Yes. And and don't holy crumbs, what the hell is that? Uh, it's so so according according to chess.com it's the indian polish variation i don't i don't yeah well, Well, it's interesting. You've played. I mean, if you've played this 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 scenario, d four, nine f six, nine f three, b five, you must have seen e four in your life. And so, hundred percent. So, oh, is that what you think it is? I had a different theory. <laughs> I had a different theory. <laughs> they have no clue what's happening. <laughs> e four. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i mean spending two three minutes on this is a uh, you know maybe i'm wrong but it, 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 it's it's a lot of it's a, it's a lot of time to spend on something that you kind of know ah oh there we go knight takes there we go bishop takes and look at that alex chris yeah 
Ooh, e6. Oh, that was interesting. I thought he would have got c6, d5. Okay, I'm expecting... Or do you castle? What about castling? Oh, the rook. Oh, I didn't see rook. I didn't see rook one. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't see rook one. My bad. My bad. Um, I, 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 I was, I was. Yeah, I would, I would assume bishop e, bishop b seven must be the move. Yep, there it is, bishop. Yeah. The problem I have with this this position, and it, it's it's all going to be about the bishops, right? Let's let's say hypothetically you tra you trade your black knight. The problem is you can't, um, and and you say you castle. You can't play a move like d five because it blocks your light squared bishop, which is which is what you actually want. You want the light squared diagonal, so you can't play d six, uh, d five. You can't play knight c six because of the same principle, right? So, what do you do now? Okay, so. Oh, you play C. Well, I mean, I. I think I think I think f five is prone to knight to e four uh, e five knight e five with the idea with the idea of queen h five. Mm. Okay, so we can't go to ball three. Mm. Oh, oh no. No, no. What? Well, how far? The full bar. This is the, okay, so C4 is played. It's a bit weird, isn't it? The problem is, yeah, but that's the thing. Is the, your problem is you're playing against a GM now. You've given him six minutes in a standard queen's queen's gambit type of setup. Wrong site. Wrong 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 site. <laughs> Um, shall we, shall we come back to the board three? I'm a bit, I'm a bit, it's a bit suspect, as they say. All right. Oh, yes. Zero polity. Um, now I want to. Sure, 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 sure. What's, what's this? A... Was this a, a London setup? Was this a London setup? No, it's a cat. No, it's a cat. Catalan. Okay. No, no, that's, that's fine. No, no, I, no, I, I saw bishop before, but I forgot the bishop in uh, London needs to be on d3. So, all good, all good. Catalan, Catalan, it is. Um. Yeah. Yeah. 
But that's why A4 should have probably been played a little earlier as well. What uh, if was oh. can I play E can I can I play E four if you play A four? Oh right. No 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 I'm 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 merely, I'm merely looking for uh solutions. But hang on, hang on. That, uh, but then the pawn's also attacking my rook. Okay, no, that, that doesn't work. Okay, so there's, there's, there's A4. Well, I mean, is... Hold on, is, isn't knight, knight D2 here with E4 a big threat? Oh my gosh, 9A5, that was not... Oh, you know why? E4, bye-bye queen, yeah. Wow. Wow. I don't mean, it, look, it looks... Again, it's one of those moves, it looks so wrong, and yet it is so right. Oh, okay. Is that the queen? Is that the queen gone? Rook takes bishop, queen takes queen b eight. But then, I mean, you're the exchange down. Oh, and then you could go. Oh, hello. No, he has to do that. He has to do that. Oh, uh, bishop takes queen. Rook takes rook. Rook takes rook. Bishop takes. He's going then. Oh, that's I don't I don't know. Black seems to be in control here. Well he, he, he try to get another pawn for a piece. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, no 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 it was it was bad for white. Bad but I mean it was bad because the, the no, Queen Eight. Oh, sorry. I thought you were. I thought you were well aware of what was going on. No, no. No, 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 no. The bishop. The bishop taking the bishop was a key factor in, in attacking the bishop on a five. Yeah. No, it wasn't. It's wrong. Looks like zero bullet is looks like zero bullet could I think I think knight d two back back knight d two instead of knight a four is probably better. Cause then you can play e four. Yeah. Seems that way. Look, it's not, it's not, it's not doom and gloom. It's a rook and a pawn versus a bishop and a knight, effectively. I wouldn't say it's over. I would say, yeah. Oh, yeah, I mean, you got, you got rook c one. Rook c. Well, you could get you. Oh, you know what? You know it's an interesting move here. Yeah. Rook c2, knight to e4, e5. 
Yeah, Rick C. said. Well, the knight is threatening knight C6. Oh, now, no, 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 now it's making a bit. Wow. Yeah, but I can still play rook b7, controlling the two important files. Uh, I wouldn't. Ooh, rook b5, knight, knight e4, bishop e6, knight c6, checkmate. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> I'm awake. <laughs> so, that's C6. Absolutely. Absolutely. The knight, the knight C6 is, is, uh, is very dangerous because it is attacking two pieces and the king. Yeah, I, I, I must admit, I think... I think that's the right move. I just don't know. It does rook. It is rook b seven. Yeah, and then you're down a piece. He's got the what? Oh, the knight. The knight is hanging. And then rook rook b seven. Oh, beautiful play! Oh, beautiful play! Yeah, you you gotta you gotta give beauty you gotta give beauty there. That was beautiful. Yeah, yeah. White pulling it back there. Looks looks like it. No, the pawns are not good, but the king can get into the game and cause some chaos here. This guy, this guy goes. This rook and pawn should be an ending. No, no, I'm saying why it's winning this, and you go, oh no, no, this should be a draw. <laughs> but the, the pawns are fine. Your king can get in. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, what? Yeah, well, you got you got the dark squares. I'm also looking at this that I can. Your rook on a7 can't leave the a file. You can't leave the a file. If you get that opportunity. My question is, if I... I'm saying slight advantage white. Okay, but if you play rook c7, I play b3. And you got rook check. Oh, yeah, you got rook check. Pawn takes, rook takes, rook to b7, pick up the pawn on, G2, on g7. Look, it's interesting. Yeah, I took... Computer crashed. <laughs> no, rugby seven. So, so what? King, king to here. King to b four. King c three. C three. King b four. Oh. So can I can I play king? Can I play king c three here? King b four. Oh, you got you got you got rook c four. Okay, no 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 no. I I get you got rook c four check. So I can't play that yet. I was. 
I was looking at G4 H4. Well, the the close. What about what about what about just playing a move like B three? Oh, board four is a draw. Okay, let's go to board. You want to go to board three? Yeah. Well, are you telling me you're going to play this? What about what about knight takes what about knight takes e three here? Oh yes, he's got pawn takes. That's a bit of a pain. Yeah, you don't want to take it then. Ooh, that's a nice move. Oh, play rook b two. But then you've got c4, c5. Oh, knight d3, come on. Knight d3. No, but I can play c5. No one's... I don't, I don't, I don't like the knight there. To be honest, so I. But are we going to play bishop d8 first? So maybe f5 now. Yeah, there's f there's f5. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> All right, so we're going to board one. Yep, dragons are down to points. The dragon. Yep, and that's the chess club Politica play.
I don't know if white is that. I mean, yes, the 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 pieces are better, but black's pulling this nicely back. Okay, all black's pieces are doing a defending. Wait, all black's pieces are doing a defending. I, I will agree with that. That's interesting. That's interesting. I was looking at Queen. I was looking at Queen A2 actually. I thought Queen A2 was a better option. Yeah, yeah. I thought Queen A2 was a nice way of doing it. Okay, H6. That's interesting. I'm assuming we're getting E5 here. E4. D D three here. No, no. This looks very. This looks very droish. He's he's looking for he's looking for knight d six. Thing is, well, I could. Oh, I don't, oh, that's clever. That's clever. Giving the king. See, because there comes the knight to d six. Is what I thought to hit the f seven pawn. It seemed clever at the time. My takes. No, this is global. Well, I think this is Roish. Queen F6. Yeah, but... Yeah. I just I'll play Queen E seven yeah. Is it Queen H one? Okay, so King King H one now. Queen D one. King H Queen H one Queen D one Yeah I wouldn't. 
I wouldn't take the queen though. Ooh, it's... Yeah, the, the, the problem with queen d7 is he's got g4 straight away, and the queen's already on the f3 square, so... Just... My, my question is, queen takes, queen pawn takes, isn't that a draw? Yeah, no, it, it... Yes, no, I get that. Oh, is it is it trouble here? Oh, you know it's an interesting move. It's bishop, a uh, queen f three, bishop uh, d five, is interesting. Yeah. That's check. That's beautiful. Can't play bishop e two, bishop to e five again. Queen check. There seems to be a perpetual brewing here. Queen g2 stops everything. Queen e2. Draw. Called it. Yeah, yeah, we called it. We called it. All right, let's go to board two. Absolutely. <clears throat> Was it, but wasn't wasn't white a pawn up initially? Wait, white was a pawn up initially. Yes. Oh yeah. But I did say I did say it was chances for white. I said so. Yeah, rook and pawn engines, baby. Now, interesting, interesting fact. Interesting fact for this position. Interesting fact. Should just up to go win this one? They go three one up. With one and a half points needed from four games. And you've got two whites. That's where you've got to get. I. That's interesting. Did they win with whites? I am curious. Yeah. Well, they're winning with whites here. So board two is white. Board four is white. So they've won one white, one black. And that's good. If you've won with your black pieces, you're going to feel confident to win with your white pieces. Hold on. Isn't B, isn't, isn't B6, B7 winning yet? Well, king takes pawn now. Yeah, he resigned. Yeah, this is this is. I mean, again, very well technical ability with the rook and pawn there. We didn't see the, red, the whole of it, but you know, a pawn up with lots of pawns. If there were fewer pawns, I would agree with you. It would be tending to go towards a draw. But because there were so many pawns on the board, White had to have the advantage. No, we didn't. But it's okay. I'll I'll take the win for that one. <laughs> Hundred percent. Shall we go to board four? Uh, who, 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 who's board four? Kristoff. Oh no! Don't say crazy. Oh my gosh! Queen takes queen. Pawn takes bishop. It was well. It was a bit. Uh, 
and, and well, if you play rookie one, I can play rook takes pawn. I've always, I've always got knight d3 when I need it. Yeah, yeah. Look, black, black, black wouldn't, black wouldn't mind the draw here. White needs the win. What? My day three is setting up, mate. Ah, the pawn, the pawn on f5 is also hanging, eh? So I think you've got to play, I, I think you've got to, I think you got to play knight h3. I think knight d3 is the idea. I like rook g2, but then rook takes f5. Yeah, I also tend to think that... I'm also tend to think that white should be winning this. It feels like black is, I mean, black looked like he came back. It just, it, it wasn't enough. Oh, how's this for a move? Knight d4. Knight d4. Oh my gosh. Yeah, must have been. Now, the, this these are less pawns. Yeah, this is less pawns though. But the problem is, oh, I wasn't even worried about that. I wasn't even worried about that. You can play knight takes knight, pawn takes, rook takes pawn. You got king g3. You got the two. Yes. No, no, I, I know. I know you're saying that. I'm saying that knight takes knight, pawn takes, king g3 is also satisfactory. No, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking that uh, if uh, if you keep the look, the more pieces that you keep on the board, right? The more pieces you keep on the board, black can fight back. That's my concern. So if you play knight takes c7, rook takes a7, I can. You know, I've always got rook check and think. You know, it's 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 messy.
And I think also, if I remember correctly, these two pawns, because they separated and you've got a rook, it's more of a win than if they were together. Because um, if I... Okay, so hypothetically speaking, if these, if the two, four pawns were gone, right, and the white pawn was on g3 and the black pawn was gone, black has chances to draw. Yeah, no, but, I'm, but you, understand, you understand what I'm saying. But because, because the pawns are split, it's more of an advantage to win than it is to, to draw. And, and the, only, the only reason why I say this is I actually did this in game not so long ago with one of my students. <laughs> so I, I, know for, I, I actually know that the split pawn is better than the two pawns together. And it makes no sense because you'd think that the two pawns together would be better. They not, but the, yes, hundred percent. Yeah, no. The rook, the rook keeps the king out, and the king stands in front of the pawns. And it doesn't matter what you do; you can't push the pawns forward, and you can't get your king forward because the rook and the king stop the king from coming. Because you need the king in front of the pawn, and that's the problem. But when it splits, you can move the pawn. You, you know, you can sack one pawn, push the other pawn, and, and queen. That's the the dynamic. I drew a game with white here, but not knowing this. Oh, I drew. A... Why would we get? I would get. I would get what? A draw for black or, draw, or 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 white wins. Who's got white? If, oh, if you got white. Oh right. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I, th I think King G three Rook F four is the is is the look. These two pawns here can't move. I mean, the pawns on on C and B can't move. And except when they're connected, and and except when they're on the A and B and G and H um, squares, it, it it's the only time that it's it's yeah. Um, uh, Lev Halbert, just the facts. Uh, rook and pawn endings, uh, uh, chapter four or something, and it's go have a check. It's 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 there. And please, if I if I if I if I've got it wrong, please let me know. <laughs> but I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty sure I've got it right. I, I know the two connected pawns you can draw with. That I do know. I'm hundred percent sure of that. Which is why the split pawns are are nice. Well, this is interesting. Hmm. Do you? Yeah, but if you keep the inside pawn, you can't get your rook close enough. No, I agree, but the, the rook is the, if the oh, okay, never mind, he played Whoa. Well that's interesting. How about we just how about we just create a pass pawn? <laughs> right, we are. At, wait, we're not going to move from this game because we're actually going to see this in uh, in action. The split pawn versus the rook. It's three and a half, one and a half, board one, one and a half, board one, Drew. They need one point. Chess Politica. Two wins and a draw. Two wins and a draw. All right, here we go. Here we go, here we go. I reckon White's going to, White's going to win this for Club Dragons. That makes it three and a half, two and a half with, with two games to go. Yes. I, I'm I'm looking I'm looking at okay, so he, he actually plays F four. I was looking at the move H five H four here.
Well, here they go. Here goes the king lead. Yes. In fact, isn't this? Yeah. So, the, so, so here he'll have to defend on the the, the long the long side, but he'll need to pick up the h two pawn. That's the catch. Yes, we can agree to that. Yeah, yeah, we can agree on that. <laughs> but and and the and the reason <laughs> the reason the reason is a draw because the, you actually need the king on the other side, on the open side, not on the short side. Because the king's on the short side, you are able to to get this. So I'm very confused on. Yeah, it's... yeah, there we go, Rick D2, yep. Yeah. So now I can, I can play King of Six, yes. 100%. Oh, why did he go there? Oh, so, no, no play. Beautiful. And he's going he's to play King E6 again. Oh. Now, there we go. It's Rook G2. Yeah, there we go. And I'm assuming that the rook's going to go to e7 now. I would have thought the rook. I thought the, I thought the rook was going to go to e7. To be honest. Yeah. There we go. Rook e7. Again, you just play the simple. What about rookie two? What about rookie two? Yeah, rookie three. Okay, so rookie three for the main threat. King to e6. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. Board three is the decider. Why is board three the decider? We're on board four. Why is board three the decider? We'll have to go look. Oh, this is beautiful. Here we go. This is this is it. This is this is the win. King King yeah. F six. Push the board to F six. Now he's going to decide what he wants to do. Yeah, that's not going to work. Um, rook, rook, rook d3. Rook d3. Two minutes. Oh, but then he's, oh wait, he's got rook g2. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Yes. And now the king goes, oh, king e, king e6. He's just done this a little differently. He's just done this a little differently. This is, now, if the rook goes down, the rook can go in the way for check, isn't it? And good night, three tarts. King there. Yeah, this. Check.
maybe not. Sure, Black's holding this hard. Yes. And now Rook, now Rook D5. Okay, Rook B5. That don't think it makes much of a difference. Oh, he can't take the board. He can't take the Rook. He can't take the Rook. Beautiful. Now, what? Don't you don't you play Rook G1 and just stay behind this King now? He shouldn't have dropped that H2 pawn. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, that, yeah, it, white, white stuff. This, yeah, it's a draw. Well played by Black, though. Well, he dropped the pawn. He's, you, you can't drop the pawn. That's the thing. Yes. And just this is not this is not a draw. Beautiful play by Black. Beautiful play by Black. Black. Oh, Rick takes Rick. And there, there we go. There's the draw. All right. Politica need half a point. Let's go to board three. Peter Peter was... All right. Let's go have a look. Okay. Who's what? Goran has, is... Oh. Yeah. If white, if oh king there. Yeah, we are both three, and it's a winner. And Chess Club Politica are the World Chess League champions of 2024. They have done it again. I called it. I called it. I called it. Okay, I did say I did say four and a half, three and a half. Five three is about the same bloody score line. <laughs> Unbelievable stuff. Uh, but I, I, I did I did point it in Chess Club Politica's favor. <laughs> I, I, I will I will t I'll take small victories. But again. Well, well, look at look at look at look at the results, right? The GM on board one drew both games. Okay, the the IM, which is what you expect against an IM, one one, absolutely spot on. The GM on board two dominates board three, and then the IM against the FM on board four, total draw. He absolutely, absolutely, but I think the big difference, but I think the difference is even though the ratings are similar, the one's a GM, the other is an iron. Absolutely, Peter, absolutely. I mean, you couldn't ask for a better final. Who's who's Zura? You would know who Zura is, Peter. Zura. Good games. This is Zura. Congrats to the winners and thanks for the commentary. Zura Pelletti. Oh, dude, you you played amazing. We, we bro, we were watching your games insanely. It was top notch, bro. Top notch. Top notch. <laughs> I am Zura. <laughs> no, it was. It was <laughs> no, look. Um, 
Peter, this is um, Chess Club Politica's third title. Yes. I knew something that Peter didn't know. Do da, do da. Yes. Tiger Sharks. Oh, look at it. Look, look at this senseless friend running, running, running for the Euros. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to having you again, Daniel. <laughs> it would it would listen listen i'm already dumb as it is now you want to be a car here as well <laughs> Oh yes, sorry. While, while I got you, Daniel, you're gonna you're gonna play for Chess here as next season, okay? It's not negotiable. Yeah, fantastic. Done. <laughs> it's not negotiable. No, no. What 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 we're gonna do is we're gonna form a team of about five or six players, and you or you one of those. Ideally, I won't play when everyone else can play, because then I can stream it. But if anyone, then I'll, you know, you know we'll, we'll make it work. We'll make, we'll, we'll create a Facebook uh, uh, chat like, like Peter does. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, well, if it's anything to go on your rock and porn end games, don't go there. <laughs> Uh, run to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, I'm going to hit the button that says go to YouTube. 
yeah, publish the stream as well. Absolutely. Well, good, we get a break. Woohoo! <laughs> Okay. Perfect. All righty then, guys. So, any last words from you, Peter? All right, Peter. Ah, oh, I, I, I want to. I want to make one big shout out, Peter. Just one big shout out. Oh, okay, actually two. Actually two. Let's quick two. Two quick. A big shout out to Peter to organizing this event and managing 80 teams with 80 captains and 80 dramas and all the rest of it. He's always polite. He's always nice. Sometimes you're getting on a bad day, but he's generally a very nice guy and he's done an exceptional job running this event. And, uh, and hopefully next season, it's going to be even better. And the second shout out, big shout out to chess.com for, um, they they sponsor for the the, the prize fund and uh, uh, bridge and chess. What's the chess and bridge? What's that one called, Peter? Ch and chess and bridge for the vouchers and all the rest of it. Any other other, other sponsors you missed out on? So just those two. Please say no to what not. To chess and bridge and to chess.com. Thank you very much for having us have this event. And uh, hopefully we can go, for, well, yes, we are going forward with it for the next season. Guys, come back, check us out. We'll be back September or October. Keep an eye out on the stream. Keep an eye out on Peter. Harass him to enter your teams. Let's let's make Peter's life hard. Let's get to 150 teams. Just to upset Peter one more time. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Have a great evening.